Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to resolve if you're coming across an Intel DCH graphics driver installation error on your Windows 10 device. So I imagine this could definitely be a frustrating issue. And in today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to hopefully go about it without too much of a hassle. And we're going to go and jump right into it. So the first thing I would suggest would be to open up a web browser, doesn't matter which one. And I'm going to have a link in the description of my video. I want you guys to copy it and paste it into the address bar up at the top of the browser window. And you want to scroll down until you find the Intel Graphics Windows 10 DCH drivers. And go ahead and just select that. Should be near the top of the list at the time of this recording. And give it a moment here. On the left side, underneath Available Downloads, go ahead and select the .exe file. It's about 330 megabytes, so it will take some time to download depending on your internet connectivity speed. Just give it a moment here to download.
Okay, so once it's done downloading, we're just going to go ahead and open that up like you would any normal download on your computer. You might get a security notice here. Go ahead and select Run. User account control prompt should say Intel Graphics Driver Software. Go ahead and select Yes. So I'm getting a little error here because I'm in a virtual environment and I'm not actually running any Intel graphics drivers in this virtual environment even though the host machine actually has an Intel processor in it. Uh, so that's a little bit ironic but generally speaking from this point forward the installation process should be fairly simple. You just would pretty much just click next, you follow the end user license agreement terms whatnot. It really does not require much user input from there so I'm, I don't feel too bad about not including that in this tutorial because we're pretty much we're already 90% of the way there. You guys should be able to take it over from here. So as always, thank you guys for watching this brief tutorial. Do hope that I was able to help you out and I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.